Terrace's Hockeyville committee is asking people to wear hockey sweaters and take a hockey stick to work or just for a walk this week. It's the final week before the deadline for the top 10 cities across Canada. Co-coordinator Bruce Martindale says this will show Terrace has the spirit and is for real. What we're trying to do right now is uh, show the world that we're really serious about that. And that, that means that there's a lot of people around Terrace who are walking around with these jerseys on and with a hockey stick in their hand just to tell you that we're already assuming that we're in the top 10. We're moving forward as if we're going to make it all the way and we, we are playing this one to win. The mix since the best of the 80s, 90s, and now it's Colin Smith hanging out. Martindale adds once the December 6th deadline comes, the committee will continue planning events and acting as if they've made the top 10. And on December 6th, it's the Parade of Lights in Terrace. This year's theme obviously has a bit of a twist. There's a lot of floats that are going to go with a the hockey theme to show that we are Hockeyville. I know that I'm going to be out there in my jersey and I've got this 50-foot banner and I'm going to be trying to promote that with a, a bunch of our crew anyway from the committee. Uh, it's just time for us to just say we are Hockeyville, let's be Hockeyville and we will be Hockeyville. It's that simple. December 6th is the cutoff date for the essays to be put on the CBC website from Terrace. Currently, there's about 250 stories on the website from Terrace. The committee is doing a drive for five right now. They'd like to reach 500 essays by December 6th. That way, they'll figure they'll breeze into the top 10. For CFTK TV Sports in Terrace, I'm Andrew Deans.